All right, guys, I'm just going to give you a quick demonstration of the uh, progress of the Lock Widgets application. I've been kind of swamped lately, and I haven't had a lot of time to work on this, but I'm trying to get it out, uh, maybe a beta out by next week, hopefully. Um, so what you're about to see is the Lock Widgets application. It's largely unfinished, needs a lot of TO and facelifting and stuff like that. But uh, basically, here's the uh, basic UI. You can choose a Bing wallpaper of your own. And uh, you can go ahead and add your widgets in. So we'll go ahead and add a weather. Uh, and enter in my zip code. Or if you're international, you can uh, usually type in uh, your city, comma, country, like one, um, London, England, or whatever. And uh, I'll go ahead and add an RSS feed in there. And here I can put in my feed URL, and it already has the Windows Finacker RSS in there just for uh, convenience. And uh, I'll go ahead and hit preview. And there's a, now there's my salad, and here's a, just a preview of what this would look like on my lock screen. And go back. And uh, I can also use the Bing wallpaper when I want to do this, and I can get a preview on that. And uh, there's that with today's Bing wallpaper. And uh, that'll update as uh, the Bing wallpaper changes. And uh, once that's done, I can just press update now. And I should be able to turn my phone off and... Pop that up, back up, and there's my lock screen. I've got my widgets up there. Um, and a couple of other cool things you can do. Um, this is rearrangeable thanks to a control I found uh, over on MSDN. And so you can uh, rearrange your widgets like that. You can tap on them to remove them and all that good stuff. So hopefully you'll like this. Uh, be sure to give me some suggestions on what you want to see as far as widgets go. And uh, I'll be tightening up the UI and getting some uh, more information about this out as soon as possible. So thanks for watching.